Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for Monday, April 30th. This is for Monday, April 30th. Daily vibes. This is for all signs. Whatever comes up today, comes up today. You know, these, the timing is fluid. It's the message that I'm picking up on. Monday, April 30th. Tough decision ahead. Tough decision. Somebody's at a stalemate. They're stalled, <laughs> of course. Difficult decision, painful choice. Do I stay? Do I go? What do I do? Do I see the truth? Do I accept this truth? Do I face my fears? Do I bury my fears? Do I block this out? What do I do? Somebody's gonna block it. Somebody's not gonna communicate and they're gonna hold it in. Somebody is needing to stop avoiding something. Avoidance doesn't help. It really doesn't. Somebody has completely lost their will, lost their willpower, lost their drive. Completely stuck in a rut. Stubborn, hot headed. Feeling complacent. There could be even some unwise decisions happening at this time. Somebody's totally. N turning a blind eye to the truth, not wanting to accept it, so they're blocking it, pushing down their emotions. Very insecure at this time. Unstable. But a clear decision is needed. You know, it's time to make that decision. Make the choice. It's decision-making decision, decision making time. You can only block it for so long. Find your courage. Find your confidence. Find your strength. And your focus. Follow your passions. It's time to do the honorable thing. Get creative if you have to. Take the lead. But there's a loss of faith. There's a loss of trust here. I don't I can't I don't even believe in myself anymore. I don't believe that I can move forward. Lack of commitment. Lack of, like I said, there's a lot of insecurities here. Somebody is very insecure with their own feelings, right? I mean, that's what's going on here. Your intuition knows exactly what I'm talking about right now. Whatever's coming to your mind as I speak is what we are talking about. Trust your intuition at this time. You are seeing a situation absolutely clearly. You know what the decision is that you have to make, but you're unable to follow through with it. You should be celebrating. 
You should be having fun. Instead of feeling repressed. Somebody is going through a period of repression. Holding in their true feelings. When they know that they, they shouldn't be. They know what they need to do. There's no growth. Wherever you're at. You have to take a step. You have to find the confidence and the courage. To take that step that's going to make you happy. But. Your intuition's telling you what to do, but you're not listening. You're not taking any action. Somebody's not taking any action in regards to what their inner guide is telling them, even though they're hearing it clearly. Somebody's become emotionally unavailable. I'm hurt. I'm so hurt that I can't even move forward. You're letting the hurt control you. There's like a, I don't feel loved. I don't feel loved. I'm not getting the love that I want. Somebody's feeling very weak, unstable, insecure, selfish. emotionally unavailable to the point where they're closed they've closed themselves right off I've, I've closed myself right off somebody may have closed themselves off so much that they can't even think about love right now they're burying themselves in their job or their finances or their money or their home their job mostly only focusing on everything but love at this time because they've been so deeply hurt by a situation It's time to make a conscious change and stop blocking your feelings, stop blocking love and find the courage and the confidence to regain your focus and relight that fire within with that king of wands in the basis, the middle of the reading. Find your confidence and your courage that has been lost to make a conscious change to release these negative thoughts Accept the truth, which somebody has been denying. Make the clear decision. And take the next step that your intuition is telling you to take. Your intuition is telling you, but you're not listening. And it's causing a lot of hurt, sensitive, over-emotional feelings. There could be a lot of tears. A lot of crying. Like I said, you should be looking at this through, you know, this is a time of freedom. It is. This is. These are both freedom. Look at this as a time of liberation, as a new start. This is, this is a time of personal freedom. This is look at things from a different perspective. Don't let all this hurt, whatever has happened, hold you back. Now you get to start something new. There's a new beginning right in front of you. Don't let this hurt steal your power and your truth. Be open to newness. This is a time of liberation, personal freedom. Something has been released. 
now you have an opportunity for something better. If you could just open your eyes and see it that way. The worst is over. All you have to do now is step outside of your comfort zone to bring abundance back to your life. Take back your power. Follow your intuition. Make a clear decision. Accept the painful truth. And make the conscious change that you know you need to make. Step outside of your comfort zone. Look at things from a new perspective. Be open to the possibilities of this newfound freedom. 10, 10, 10. Completion, completion, completion. Something has ended so that something much better could begin. Stop resisting it. Stop. It's supposed to be a time of appreciation working together. You might have to make some compromises. You might have to even communicate. But it's definitely time to struggle through this and let go. Stop sacrificing your happiness. And stand up. Take a risk. Be happy. Stop stalling your own happiness because that's exactly what you're doing. Because you have this fear, you're protecting yourself. Protecting yourself from getting hurt again. By staying and sacrificing yourself for these emotions. You're letting your, the emotions hold you back. That's a protective tactic. Protecting myself by being overly emotional, which I can see with all those cups reversed up there that are under here. Somebody's overly emotional. They're holding on to the hurt to protect themselves from being hurt again. When they have the ability to just let it go and start over. There's been some loss. There's been some regrets in the past. But you still have other opportunities. But someone has lost all hope. And they're trying to protect themselves from future hurt because of the past hurts. It's time to restore that hope. Make this conscious change that is so much needed. It's time to come out of this darkness and walk away from being controlled and manipulated. somebody has been manipulating them their own their self sabotage here i don't even need the cars to see it they've been sabotaging their themselves protecting themselves from being hurt again you're being called to step out into the light and start over completion 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 when something ends something better begins Wherever you are at or whatever you're doing is unrealistic. Your intuition knows what it is. So today is a day of accepting what is over. No longer avoiding the truth. Looking at life from a new perspective. Taking back your power making some compromises, finding the courage, the confidence, and the strength 
to refocus and accept the truth of a situation Stop sabotaging yourself. There's no doubt about it. Somebody has been sabotaging their, their self. Sabotaging their growth. When they have an opportunity to make a conscious change to begin again in a new direction. Embrace the moment. Embrace this day, this very moment. Think positively today and repel those negative thoughts. Try not to judge yourself or others. This may be harder than you think. What is actually happening is that you're changing your energy. And that is what is exactly what is going on. Whatever it is you're trying to block out and protect yourself from in the future, it needs to be released. Completion, completion, completion. Release it and start over. Scorpio, full moon. Talk to you later.